Hey, what's up guys? My name is Pro and we're back with another video and today I'm going to be showing you how to change your .aep file to a .mov file. And this is for, of course, for Adobe After Effects CC or any latest version or earlier version, of course. Um, and it's actually really simple to do. It's just like my rendered video. I actually added it in there, but I figured I would just do two, like do two separate videos because when you search it up, you might find you won't find the same video. So um, this one, yeah. So it's just gonna be changing how like like I just mixed my whole tongue up there. Let's see how to change your dot uh, AEP file into like a movie file, a quick time player or something you whatever you use for your movies. And I'm just gonna be using my intro. I don't have my files because um oh frick what my intro what. What is going on? What? The file is not found. Let me see. Hold on there a second. Hmm. That's really weird. I don't know what the hell just happened. Did I just lose my whole freaking thing? What? Hold on, let's see real quick. I just lost it. What the frick? That's weird. Um, okay. Never mind then. Um, I'm just gonna have to just make up something here. I just gotta add some pictures. Cause it won't let me add anything. So I'm just gonna add. I don't know. I guess I'll just add this. I don't know. I'm just gonna keep adding this crap. I don't know what I'm doing. I honestly don't know. <laughs> I'm just adding weird stuff, so don't even ask me. Oh, wait, um... New project. Don't save. Um... Go to composition, new composition. Uh, yeah, that's good. And, let's see, let me open my files. It's weird that my thing is not showing up all of a sudden. Oh wait, what's my Minecraft show? I don't even remember that. It's really weird. Um, uh, sorry, this is taking a little bit longer. I guess I'll just do this. Just add diamonds from all over the place. Be like the diamond master. Even though I'm not really a big fan of diamonds. No, I am. Everybody's a big fan of diamonds. I'm a cake master, so I like cake. Okay, so, um, you have your, uh, whatever. Let's see. I'm just going to make them rotate, I guess. I guess i got to add, like, a whole thing right now. Um, position it. Oh, frick. Oh, wait, hold on. No. What the hell? Wait, hold on a second. Don't save. Sorry, this is taking a little bit longer than expected. I'll just scroll through it. Um, pictures, diamond, shrink it, shrink it, why is it so small, wait, hold on a second, I remember I know how to fix this, but I totally forgot. You know what, whatever. I'm just going to do it from here. Okay, so um, I'm just going to add position to both of these diamonds. And then I guess I'm just going to go here. And I'm just going to move this one here. And this one here. So that when I go back, it just does that. Whatever. Um. Okay, so sorry that took... I had to redo that real quick. Um. But since you have, like, your video... You, what you want to do is you want to go to composition and you want to go to add to render queue and it'll get this like little setting right here make sure you have render checked by the way you don't want it to be unchecked because you want it to be queued um you'll have best settings here and lossless best settings you want to make sure it's on best and full because you don't want to have it on anything else um these are just like advanced settings if you want to change it a little bit um make sure you save it to a file because it will not work 
and then you want to click lossless and you'll have a format right here and you could it'll have like a scroll down memory like menu and you want to click whatever um like uh file you have like you have photoshop sequence you have quicktime quicktime is like the one that i use and that's where it comes out to you can also use the iff this is af a i f f is what people use so you just want to um, format that to QuickTime, and you want to use 48 gigawatts, and then you just want to click OK, then it'll render. Yeah, very simple. It's rendered. Wow, it's rendered. And so you want to exit out, and then where did I save that? I don't know. Let's see, what was it called? Was it this one? Yeah, it was this one. So, yeah, see, now it's converted to whatever you had it to, and I use QuickTime Player, of course. Um, now you just wanted to let it convert by itself, and it'd be really quick, and it just gives you a full HD video. It's mine is barely, like, a second. <laughs> That's freaking horrible. I don't know. So, yeah, see how easy that was? It was not hard at all. Um, yeah, so, if you have any questions, please comment them in the box below. Uh, also, if you like this video a lot, then like the video, because it just makes sense. Also, subscribe to my channel, and I'm going to have some latest first vids on my Xbox soon, once I get back to my home layer. And I will see you guys later. Pro Servo is out of the game. That was pretty gay, but whatever.